You are an IAS officer? Sir, 2014 batch, sir. You, you, you are not in proper dress, sir. Why sir. I should hear you when you are not in the proper sir, dress Sir, sir, I beg your pardon, sir. 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 What, sir? Sir, uh, On program... reasonable doubt, you can hang uh, somebody. Sir. Uh... Serial number 9, Kanchan Kumari versus the State of Bihar for the prisoners to promote Misra. Lord Sir, in compliance of my Lord's order, 9th May, District Magistrate Madhapura Respondent number 4 is present in court, Lord Sir. Which order? Lord 9th sir. May order. There was a direction to appear in person, Lord Sir. Yes, sir. Who is there? District Magistrate Lord. My Lord. You are an IAS officer? Sir, 2014 batch, sir. You, you, you are not in proper dress, sir. Uh, sir. Uh, I'm show extremely me, sorry, sir. Show me any exemption. Sir. Where is the exemption for dress code? Sir, uh, I was been told that I must wear the tie. The, huh? I must wear the tie, sir. Otherwise, huh? I'm in a formal sir, attire, sir. I, 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 I beg your pardon, sir. Then why I should hear you when you are not in the proper sir, dress sir, code? Sir, sir, I beg your pardon, sir. Sir, sir I'm sorry, sir, for that. Uh, that is the only word available. Sir, sir. Next time, I will be careful, sir. Uh, why, uh, why, uh, what is this, uh, the Anganwari Seveka selection, uh, uh, the, how did you come to the conclusion that it is a forged document? Sir, where is, uh, it, this where is, is a the finding? Sir, sir, it's an old case, sir. My predecessor came to this conclusion, sir. Sir, there was a reasonable doubt because the school passing certificate. No, if it is reasonable doubt, you should uh, hold an inquiry, preliminary inquiry. Yes, and sir. And have you given an opportunity to the petitioner? Sir. Before declaring that uh, you have produced forged document? Sir. What, sir? Sir, uh, inquiry was been ordered by the district magistrate, but inquiry, I am, I am afraid, sir, it was not been concluded. So, on the basis of this reasonable doubt, the order was been passed by the district So, on program. reasonable doubt, you can hang uh, somebody? Sir, uh, of course not, sir. Uh, then, what is uh, the steps is required to be taken? Sir, inquiry must be concluded and uh, uh, there should be a proper evidence that the document is forged or not. Huh. So, it must have been concluded, sir. Concluded in what manner? Uh, sir, uh, the letter must have been given to the board examination, uh, examine, uh, board which conducts the examination. The board would have said that this document is forced or not forced. Huh. They are and, the only authority to say it's forced. petitioner should be given an opportunity before uh, uh, passing any adverse order. Yeah. S sir, uh, opportunity has been given, sir, by the, my predecessor. Show me the material. When uh, the petitioner was given material, these uh, are the, all the forged documents, sir. Please ex give your explanation. Sir, they were present on my files at the multiple occasions. They were been present to the court, sir. And, uh, Not present, sir. Whether have you issued a notice asking the petitioner to give his explanation, these are the fake documents. Sir, sir, opportunity was been given, sir, and notice was been issued, sir. Sir, opportunity in the sense, have you given material to the petitioner? Along with the Shokash notice, these are the material which are fake. What is your explanation? The notice has been served, sir, but the material sir. along with it, sir, uh, I'm afraid, sir, that no such material was available. So I will set aside and remind the matter. You hold a proper inquiry. If uh, uh, the petitioner, if uh, the petitioner's uh, documents are forged or a fake document in that event, uh, sir. Take further action. Sir. Yes, take down. In the instant petition, My Lord. petitioner has prayed for the following relief. Based upon 1842, the following order was passed. Mr. So and so, the district collector, come district magistrate, Madhepur is present in the court. After a perusal of the records, he submitted that uh, petitioner has not been provided an opportunity. That apart, there is no finding that the there is no concrete finding that the petitioner has furnished a forged document. Therefore, the petitioner has made out a prima facie case accordingly. The present petition is uh, uh, accordingly the impugned order did so and so stands set aside. Uh, petition stands allowed. The concerned respondent, sorry, competent authority is hereby directed to proceed 
further in accordance with law in order to find out whether petitioner's documents are forged or not after giving ample opportunity of hearing to the petitioner at every stage accordingly the petition stands for the above exercise shall be completed within a period of 3 months 3 months sufficient sir hmm how like